Right, Adam, that's a disappointing result today. Uh, what did you make of that as a whole? Um, to, to be fair, I think they set up really well. I mean, possession-wise, I mean, they, they, they played a 5-3-2. Five, they tried to play us on the break and to stop our natural width, which I think in the first half they did really, really well. Um, I mean, you've got to give credit to um, Bedfont. They, you know, they they've done their own work, obviously, and they've they've come here and they've got the result. But disappointed with the first goal because you know we've cleared the ball, and as he's cleared the ball, he's gone to kick the ball. It's his hand. He's kicked it onto his own hand. It's not to me. That's not a pen. That's 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 soft, um, and that kind of sets a tone for the game. Um, you know, they had two other opportunities in that and they took them both, which like, is is something that we haven't been doing as late. Um, so, you know, um, fair play to them for that. Um, we went in 3-0 at half time. We come out second half and again, I think the, their fourth was never a goal. That's a foul. Um, it's a blatant foul. foul. Um, so, but it, it, it counts. Um, we changed the shape slightly. Um, we couldn't change the personnel today. We changed the shape, um, and um, it kind it kind of worked. I thought we came into the game, we scored. Um, if you if you had a game of two halves, like the first half, right half, second half, one all, um, I would have thought that would probably be a bit of a fair judge on it. But all credit to Bedfont, they they you know they did their own work and they. Um, and they got the win, so uh, it is what it is. Uh, I heard you say at the end it was a bit of a wake-up call, um, you know, to, to, to lose the game the way we did. Um, so where do we look to bounce back after this? And, um, you know, is it is it that wake-up call that we need? Well, I hope so. I hope it's a, uh, a wake-up call. I mean, it's, it's very positive in regards to all substitutions had a positive impact on the game. I thought all, all, bo- all the boys that came off the bench worked really, really hard. Um, I thought the second half performance was um, much better, but by then the game's already gone. The game was we lost that in the first half, really, to be honest. Um, so obviously we've spoken before about um, starting strong as well. Uh, do you think that was lacking today? Maybe um, we had the possession to um, to do it. I think we we lacked in certain areas. I mean, they're 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 a good side. You know, Bedford spots were always up there every year. Um, and they'll be up there again this year, um, as as will we. So it's um, hopefully yes, it's a wake up call for the boys, and they will uh, they'll learn from it, which is something they need to do. And we move on to Wednesday night. I mean, currently we have nine players unavailable, um, five long term injuries, three players away. Um, you know, a couple of suspensions. It's you know, it's but fair play to the boys in the second half. They worked hard and they went out there and tried to get something. And um, I thought on the second half performance, you've got to take the positives from that. Thank you, Adam. Cheers, mate.